All right, so once again, we are testing the new TD2 from Tinder Rocketry. We tested it the other day with a 45 pound simulated rocket and it worked well and that was fun. But um, I, I said that I would be testing it with a substantial load attached. I didn't tell, tell you what that would be. And so I, the question is, the question is, does this qualify as a substantial load? I got a cherry picker. Thanks, James. Thanks for lending it to me. You didn't know that it was going to get used for this, did you? And this is a prototype. Keep in mind that the that the um, um, the production devices will be nicely contoured, and it'll be um, anodized, and yeah, it'll be nice. Uh, and there's some dimensional changes as well. But uh, I've got the truck up. You can see I'm sliding the truck back and forth. So anyway, we're gonna test this device. Let's get see if I can get a good angle on it. I don't know, I guess that's good enough. All right, we're testing this device with a substantial load attached. I don't know, 1,000, 1,500 pounds. And we're gonna go on three, two, one. Jeez. Now, just so you know, all that noise was not the device. Where is the device? All right. Here's the device. All right, so all that noise was not the device. There it is. Get in the camera there. Oh, there. It wasn't the device. It was the cherry picker that was kind of spring-loaded. I mean, it had a lot of weight on it. So, big noise, truck dropped, device went off. And just so, so you know, this thing is capable of releasing with a substantial load still attached.